place that had, that had some hail. <laughs> it, Indiana punished. County, about Blairsville. They had that pea-sized hail, and it was wow. all over the ground. That moves south. Those cells are starting to uh, die down. But the rest of us, we're in pretty good shape. We're looking at sunshine as well as warm temperatures out there. As we take a look outside, you can see that uh, most of the showers are off to the uh, east of us, we are just on the western fringe of seeing those rain showers move through, and they're moving down to the south right now. You can see that uh, a couple of cells still moving down towards the uh, south. And as we take a closer look here, not much in the way of heavy rain left over, and not much in the way of lightning or thunder left with this as well. As these begin to die down as they dive down, but we will have some rain that will be moving down towards Farmington, Waynesburg. You're going to have some small pockets of heavy rain moving in your location as well. Temperatures, well, it depends if you've had rain or not. If you had rain, you're in the 60s. If you have not, you're very warm, including Clarion at 77, Catanning 77 degrees. Right now, though, in Somerset, 64, 68 in Greensburg, 66 in West Mifflin, 72 currently in Waynesburg. A look into downtown and lots of sunshine at 68 degrees. Windsor East, 7 miles per hour. Rainfall, we've had three hundredths of an inch of rain since midnight. Of course, over the weekend, we had an inch and a third at Pittsburgh International Airport. Of course, some locations saw much more than that as we had that soaking rain, especially on Saturday that was with us. Now, the high pressure has built in, and that means not only for today for most of us, but for all of us tomorrow on Tuesday and Wednesday. We are looking at dry conditions and warm temperatures, so it's certainly going to feel a lot more like summer as we head through the next, uh, really the rest of the week as we see temperatures rising into the 80s. Tomorrow could have a couple of areas of patchy fog. Other than that, that's going to burn off pretty quick. We'll go mostly sunny as we head through Tuesday. Then we take it into Wednesday morning, mostly clear skies. We go through the day, maybe a couple of clouds late, and that's it. So for the next 48 hours, we are in great shape. Now Thursday, that's when our next change comes. We will have showers that will be popping up, and as you can see, just about everybody will have a chance of rain on Thursday. Now overnight, 56 degrees, areas of fog will be possible. That will burn off quick. 52 degrees, for your low temperature, becoming most Mostly clear and just a light breeze in the morning. A warm one tomorrow up to 79 degrees. Mostly sunny. Winds will be light out of the west at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Temperature wise, we'll be hitting 80 degrees in some locations, including Uniontown at 80. Greensburg will be at 79. 78 for Butler and Beaver. Newcastle 77. A high of 80 in Waynesburg. 82 Morgantown. Brownsville 80 degrees. And a high of 80 in the South Hills. Wexford at 78 degrees. As we take a look at the next few days on Wednesday, that is the beginning of our stretch of 80 degree readings. In fact, we're going to the mid 80s as we head into Thursday and Friday. Wednesday, we're dry. Thursday, we will have scattered showers. And then as we go Friday and into the weekend, that's when we'll have more of a summer like pattern where we'll have uh, mostly clear skies in the morning. We'll have partly cloudy skies in the afternoon with those pop up showers that will be a uh, spotty across the uh, region into the weekend. So we take a look at our four degree guarantee tomorrow, calling for a high of 79 degrees.